Hey everyone, welcome back to Terra Mater Gardens. Today we're diving into the world of the lilac springtails. Lilac springtails to the genus Ceratophycelia are tiny soil dwelling arthropods known for their ability to spring away when disturbed using a specialized structure called a furcula. These springtails are often found in moist environments and play a crucial role in soil health and decomposition. An interesting fact about the lilac springtails is their unique color, which ranges from shades of lilac to purple. This coloration is relatively uncommon among springtails, making them a fascinating subject for entomologists and hobbyists alike. Lilac springtails are small, typically measuring around 1 to 2 millimeters in length. They have a segmented body with six legs and a furcula on their abdomen, that, which they use to propel themselves in the, to the air. Their distinctive lilac coloration makes them easily identifiable among other springtail species. Lilac springtails are commonly found in moist, organic rich soils, leaf litter, decaying wood, and compost piles. They thrive in environments with high humidity and ample organic material to feed on. These springtails are widespread and can be found in various regions across the globe. Lilac springtails are detritivores feeding on decaying organic matter, fungi, bacteria, and algae. Their feeding activity helps break down organic material, contributing to nutrient cycling and soil fertility. They are active throughout the year, but their populations can fluctuate when, with changes in moisture and temperature. Lilac springtails are generally not considered threatened as they are widespread and abundant in suitable habitats. However, they are sensitive to environmental changes such as pollution, habitat destruction, and changes in soil moisture. Conservation efforts focus on maintaining healthy soil ecosystems and minimizing human impact. That concludes today's guide on lilac springtails. These tiny, vibrant color springtails play a vital role in soil health and ecosystem functioning. Thanks for listening. If you found this information helpful, feel free to like, share, and leave a comment. Stay tuned for more insights into the fascinating world of wildlife. Until next time, happy terrarium, happy farming, happy gardening.